thing we announced um, in CES this, uh, this mm -hmm. week is actually um, the release of our 7300 single ASIC chip. Uh -huh. uh, the 7300 mm -hmm. is a um, is a 76 channel um, low power chip. And so what what that means is that um, if you look at uh, Windows 8, it has you know specifications around you know being able to support multiple fingers, um, and it's driving towards a um, an end user experience similar to what the Ultrabooks was driving towards. Which one of those things is having a long battery life. Um, from a hardware perspective, the way you get to a long battery life is you move down to um, to fewer chips. So um, you know, Flip this over. This is actually um, still in development right now, but this is our 7300 running on an ARM um, device. So this is um, supporting hit over I squared C. Um, we also have our 7300 kind of hidden in here, um, running on a x86 machine, right? So it's um, and it's it supports hit over USB. So those are the two standards on Windows 8 that are supported. Um, it support, the big thing about 7300 is that it allows you to have high performance in a single chip package. So I'm able with this chip, I'm able to support 100 hertz per finger performance. Uh, on something up to a 12-inch display, uh -huh. right? So the first sizes for Windows 8 um, that are coming out um, with the specification, of course, are 10.1-inch and 11.6-inch display. So you can see that we've um, designed this around making sure that you have the best possible performance um, in a really low-power package for uh -huh. a Windows 8 environment. Cool. Um, Great. Um,